Welcome to our video on the risk return trade-off in investments. Today, we're diving into one of the most essential concepts in finance, the risk return trade-off. Simply put, it refers to the balance between the potential for higher returns and the risks involved. It's the cornerstone of smart investing, where understanding this balance can empower you to make better financial decisions. Remember, in the world of investments, High returns often come with high risks. We'll unpack how this relationship works, why it matters, and how you can navigate it to your advantage. So, whether you're an experienced investor or just starting out, grasping the risk-return trade-off is crucial. You'll gain insights that can help align your investment choices with your financial goals. Stay tuned, as in the next segment, will define risk and return more clearly, setting the stage for a deeper exploration into their dynamics. Let's get started. Before we dive deeper, let's understand two fundamental concepts, risk and return. Risk, in the context of investing, refers to the potential for losing some or all of the original investment. It's about the uncertainty or variability in the outcomes of your investment decisions. On the flip side, Return represents the gain or loss made on an investment over a particular period. This can include profits from selling an asset, dividends received, interest earned, or appreciation in value. Now that we've outlined these basics, let's look at the different types of risks. Market risk, credit risk, liquidity risk, and operational risk. Understanding these risks and how they can impact your investments is crucial for making informed financial decisions. As we move forward, you'll see how the interplay between risk and return shapes our investment strategies and prepares you for the journey ahead. Now that we've defined what risk and return are, let's explore the core theory behind the risk-return trade-off. This principle suggests that to achieve higher returns, one must be willing to accept higher risks. This relationship forms the backbone of all investment decisions. Investment theory teaches us that not all risks are equal. The potential for earning higher returns comes with the expectation of greater volatility. For example, investing in stocks often offers higher returns but comes with significant risks, unlike more stable investments such as bonds. This trade-off isn't just academic, it plays a crucial role in how portfolios are constructed and managed. Understanding this balance helps investors align their strategies with their risk tolerance and financial goals. Remember, the goal isn't to eliminate risk completely, but to manage it wisely to achieve desired returns. Moving forward, you'll see how this theory applies in real-world scenarios. Let's delve into some real-world examples to better appreciate the risk-return trade-off. Consider high-risk investments such as stocks. Historically, stocks have offered significant returns, making them appealing to many investors. But these potential rewards come with substantial risks, including market volatility and the possibility of significant losses. Now, let's contrast this with low-risk investments like bonds. Bonds typically provide more modest returns, but they come with a higher level of security. For example, government bonds are often seen as a safer option because they're backed by the government's creditworthiness. While the returns may not be as exhilarating as with stocks, the peace of mind from lower risk is a trade many investors are willing to make. To illustrate this balance effectively, think about the differences in driving a sports car versus a family sedan. A sports car, much like stocks, offers the thrill of speed and performance, but requires a higher level of skill and comes with greater risk of accidents. Meanwhile, the family sedan, comparable to bonds, may not provide the same excitement, yet it delivers reliable performance and safety. Imagine holding a portfolio that includes both types of investments. This diversification strategy aims to balance potential high returns with more stable, lower risk investments. By doing so, investors can mitigate some of the volatility inherent in high risk assets while still aiming for substantial growth. Remember, the right mix of investments depends on individual risk tolerance and financial goals. This personalized approach is key to navigating the complexities of the risk return trade-off. Next, we'll explore how to find the right balance, taking into account personal risk tolerance and financial objectives. Balancing risk and return is crucial in the world of investments. It's not just about aiming for the highest returns, but also managing the risks you take on. 
Every investor's journey involves finding a strategy that aligns with their risk tolerance and financial goals. Risk management isn't just about avoiding losses. It's about making informed decisions that fit your unique situation. Investment strategies come in many forms, each with its own balance of risk and return. Whether you are a conservative investor looking for steady growth or a risk taker aiming for high rewards, understanding this balance is key. Pushing for higher returns can often mean exposing yourself to greater risks. So how do you find the right balance? Start by assessing your financial goals and your comfort level with risk. Then choose investment options that match this profile. In the next segment, we'll delve deeper into understanding this balance better, illustrating how different strategies can help you achieve your financial objectives while managing risk. Investing is a lot like driving a car. The faster you drive, the higher the risk of an accident. But at the same time, you get to your destination quicker. Think of higher returns as reaching your financial goals faster. However, such higher returns come with a higher risk. This analogy makes complex investment concepts easier to grasp. By using relatable comparisons, we can simplify the principles of risk and return. Understanding that taking on more risk can potentially lead to higher rewards helps investors make informed decisions. As we move forward, you'll see how this analogy can apply to various investment strategies and why balancing speed or risk against safety or return is crucial. Now that we've explored the theories and examples behind the risk-return trade-off, let's delve into its practical implications. Understanding this trade-off is fundamental for making informed investment decisions. Every investor must assess their own risk tolerance to determine the right investment strategy. Are you a cautious investor who prefers safer, low-return investments? Or are you willing to take on more risk for the potential of higher returns? Evaluating your financial goals, time horizon, and comfort with volatility is essential. This assessment helps in choosing investments that align with your personal risk profile, ensuring a balanced approach to your portfolio. Remember, the goal is not just to chase high returns, but to carefully weigh the associated risks. Next, you'll see how avoiding common pitfalls can prevent costly mistakes in your investment journey. As we navigate the complexities of investing, it's crucial to be aware of common mistakes that can derail your financial goals. One of the biggest pitfalls is focusing solely on high returns without taking into account the risks involved. It's an alluring trap seeing potential gains and forgetting that higher returns come with higher risks. Ignoring these risks can lead to significant losses, undermining your overall investment strategy. Another common misstep is overlooking the multitude of risks associated with different investment opportunities. These risks, whether market volatility or economic downturns, can have a profound impact. It's vital to thoroughly assess and understand the risks before making investment decisions. Remember, evaluating potential drawbacks is as important as chasing returns. A balanced approach where you weigh risks against the expected returns is fundamental to smart investing. This cautious yet calculated strategy helps in making informed choices that align with your risk tolerance and financial goals. Next, let's delve into how to strike this crucial balance, ensuring that your investment journey is both rewarding and secure. As we reach the end of our exploration, let's review the key points. The risk-return trade-off is a fundamental concept in investing, emphasizing that higher returns come with higher risks. Balancing these elements is essential for making sound investment decisions. Understanding this trade-off helps investors align their strategies with their risk tolerance and financial goals. From defining risk and return to exploring real-world examples and using analogies, we've covered the importance of managing both aspects wisely. Keep in mind, avoiding the common pitfalls of chasing high returns without assessing risks is crucial. By maintaining this balance, you can make more informed and strategic investment choices. Remember, investing is like walking a tightrope, one step at a time, always balancing risk and reward. Next, you'll see how to apply this knowledge in real-world scenarios, helping you become a more astute investor. Thank you for watching our comprehensive guide on the risk-return trade-off in investments. We hope you found the insights valuable and are now more confident in making informed investment decisions.
Remember, balancing risk and return is crucial for long-term success. If you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing to our channel for more educational content on investments and financial strategies. Stay connected with us to continue your learning journey. And don't forget to follow us on social media for the latest updates and additional resources. Until next time, happy investing.